What's going on guys, at Gronix here, and welcome back to a brand new series in the channel. Today we jump in to our Pokemon Light Platinum Nuzlocke. If you guys are excited as I am for the brand new project, and you guys are proud members of the Agronites, make sure to have some like button down below first. And with that being said, Light Platinum is a Nuzlocke. Uh, whoops. Fuck. Not gonna edit that out. <laughs> Light Platinum is a ROM hack uh, created in like 2000 and something, it's, it's, it's pretty recent, and it's very, very good from what I hear. Um, can't wait to jump into this. I don't know a lot about the game. Uh, I know some of the early game, you know, the characters you meet and stuff. I know that Ash catch him in the game, which is fucking crazy. Uh, but, um, I, I'm very, very excited for the, about this game, and... Um, yeah, let's jump into it. If you guys do not know what a Nuzlocke is, by the way, um, it gives you three very, very simple rules that you must apply to everything you do. You can only catch the first Pokemon in each new route. Uh, if Pokemon faints it considered dead, you must release it or box it, which is what we do. But if we box it, we can never use it again. And uh, you must nickname every single Pokemon to create a bond with them. You know, you go like, yeah, go, Jeffrey. And then, you know, your slow bro comes out and then it dies. And you're like, no, Jeffrey, no. That's the basic event, so. <laughs> Welcome to the world of Pokemon. This is Professor... Purple Hair... Oh, my name is Jasmine. But people often call me Professor. This is the type of... Po Whoa. That's a Snivy. Now, another thing about this game which is really cool. It has Pokemon from Generation 1 to 5. Which is pretty darn awesome. I, I have to say, it's pretty awesome. Sorry, I'm skipping through all she was saying. To unravel these mysteries, I've been doing research. You are... Do you have a penis or a vagina? I am so sorry. I am so sorry. I should not be saying those things. That would be human of me. It's Agron. Ah, uh, okay, you're Agron from Yellowtown. We're fucking neighbors. <laughs> Why would you say that? Now when you're... <laughs> Now's where your adventure begins. You will meet many en friends and enemies. Enemies? Whoa, I didn't sign up for this. I didn't want this. Welcome to my lab. I'll show you my research. Oh, I'll show you my fucking research. Eh? Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, so, uh, uh, uh. Well, we're 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 in purple lab zone. We're in purple lab zone now. I'm gonna turbo past this parish because if you guys know what this is, you'll see right here. It's so long. Look at this shit. They're just standing there. They fight a little bit, and that's Arceus in the middle, Giratina at the top, Palky on the left, and Dialga on the right for the younger viewers, if you can't tell because of the sprite work. Even though sprite work is actually really freaking good, I have to say. Like, the sprite work is top notch. But basically, my main character says that um, he's having a nightmare. That must have been a nightmare. And yeah. It's a Nintendo GameCube. The GameCube is connected to serve as a controller of the Game Boy Advance. You can't interact with the TV, and that's always nice. Um, and no interaction there. Okay, all right, that's fine. that's fine. Hi, Agron. I'm glad you woke up. I was waiting to give you a message from Professor Jasmine. She's asking if you call a central city. Something strange is happening there, involving Alpha, the language only you know because your father taught. You. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, mom. First of all, thank you for telling me that very crucial piece of information that I would probably know because you know I am the son that he taught it to, and I would probably know that anyway. But also. How am I the only one who knows it? I mean, I understand that... Wait, wouldn't she know it? I'm a child! Why am I getting put in these horrible situations that could end in my death? You know? You know? We're gonna save right now, because I don't trust this game. Uh, oh, you can overwrite save files? That's fucking awesome! Oh, I love this game. I love this game. I love this game. I don't know if you can do that in old GBA games, but I have to check it out. That's a Sterly on the roof. That's a proud member of the Quark City Sterlies, except it's not actually a proud member of the Quark City Sterlies. It's actually the mascot. Holy shit. Hello, friend. Is this Agron's house? Yes, that's me. Good. Professor Jasmine asked you to come get you. Asked me to come get you because she urgently needs your help in Central City. I was just on my way now. I almost forgot to introduce myself. I'm Kaori. Ka Kaori? Yes, the current champion of the Zeri League. I'm a close friend of Professor Jasmine's, and she asked me and a few of my friends to urgently look into this great mystery. She thinks it might be linked to the world's fucking creation. 
Very interesting. Let's get there as fast as we can. Salamence will fucking zoom fast as fucking shit and fucking... Look at that. That's a really cool sprite. Not even gonna lie. I want a Salamence. Salamence is fucking cool as fuck. Fucking love Salamence. Agron, they must be close to the center of the lake. How would you know that? How would you know where they are? Oh, because the thing's there. Okay. <laughs> the thing we're actually talking about is there. Who's that guy in the... Is that Ash Ketchum? Holy fuck, I didn't think we were meeting in this early. Hello, Agron. I asked for help from Ash Ketchum and Kaori for this study because it's very hazardous. If something goes wrong, everyone on this planet would be in danger. Holy shit, dude. Except for the Pokemon, because, you know, they, they're they Pokemon. I'll be careful, Professor. Hot! Okay, so... What do I make Ash Ketchum's voice? I'm trying to remember what it was from the old anime. From the, the very, very first season. How did it go again? Hi! <laughs> That's not it. <laughs> That's not it at all. Um, hi, I'm the current world champion of the Pokemon League, and Kaori is the champion of Zeri. I already know who you and Kaori are. I've seen you all my life on TV. Okay, Agron, I asked you to decipher these languages. Holy fuck, dude, I'm gonna dot 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 the shit out of this rock. The inscriptions talk about the creation of the universe. It was made by Arceus, who created the other Pokemon along with the rest of existence. But it seems that the balance of his power will gradually be broken, and the world will pass through times difficult to change of humanity. Dot, 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 dot. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, 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 Just counting how many dots there were. It really is important scripture that must be destroyed before evil forces discover its power. Okay, Professor, I will fuck the shit out of this rock. Empoleon, go. Empoleon use Hydro Pump and destroy the rock. That's a really, really nice surprise. So far, I'm in love with this game's design. I think it's fantastic design so far. We'll, like, as in terms of, um, artwork. We'll see how the game is. Like, so far, I'm liking this. I'm, I'm liking this a lot, actually. And then he was rain dancing and fills the water. That's pretty fucking sick. Okay, good job. Re and return, Volion. That's pretty nice. Okay, I have to go to Zeri League Issues. Bye-bye. Salamis, you fly. Fuck off. Okay, I'll go now, too. Goodbye, Professor. If there are any problems, let me know immediately. And, uh, no. Oh, he's not gonna... He's not gonna jump in his chairs there. No, he's just gonna walk off. Okay. Okay. Holy fuck! Where did he come from? Was he behind that pole? <laughs> Come on, dude. He's hiding behind a fucking pole. Uh, <laughs> I was waiting for these stro two strong trainers to go away. So I could force you to give me the secrets of the universe's creation. Oh, I'll fucking give you my fucking secrets of creation, you bitch. Go, <laughs> go, Puchina. Hey, Agron, take a Pokemon from my sack. Oh, well. So, oh, whoa. Wait, so this is going to be a Bulbasaur? It is indeed, and this is going to be a Squirtle. So, we have Gen 1 starters. So... Not the biggest fan of Squirtle. I like Blastoise, but it's not, you know, one of my favorite Pokemon. You know, it's pretty cool. Um, I love Charizard. I love Venusaur. I want to go with Bulbasaur. Because I know people will crucify me if I pick Charmander. <laughs> but, let's be honest. If I pick Bulbasaur, it's going to be so fucking tough. Like, I'm going to lose. So, I'm going to go with Charmander. Only because... It, like, grass types are not good in-game, uh, in terms of, like, uh, it, you know, competitively it's pretty good. We have a male level 5 chairman, and it's not bad. Um, you know, it, like, competitively, I think grass types are, are pretty underrated. I think they they can be very, very good. Um, but, in-game, you know, when so many gym leaders have, you know, types that just fuck up grass types, you know, not only that, but grass isn't uh, a great type uh, in terms of weakness and, you know, resistance and stuff. Like, it has five weaknesses in poison, ice, flying, bug, and fire. And then the stuff that resists it are all those. Uh, and steel, dragon, and that's it. Uh, <laughs> Well, Professor, this time you were lucky, but next time I'll kidnap you. Wow. Fucking get straight to the point. Be blunt as shit. From this point on, Agron is on Team Steen's hit list. So, you're just going to walk off? No guards are going to be called? No? No? Okay. Thank you very much. From now, Team Steen will be after you. I'll give you this Pokemon to protect yourself. Take care and train hard. Challenge the Zeri League and always be ready to fight Team Steen. So, wait. She knew, she knew that she knew that Team Steen existed. 
And yet she didn't fucking care. Okay. So we have a male Charmander. Um, I've been thinking about this name since we picked it. Or since we saw its uh, gender. Um, huh. Um, we could go with Fire Dog or whatever. A fucking Lizard. Okay, she's a Lizard. I'm gonna start making sounds. Okay, so let's start with G. G, I, Gibble. <laughs> no. Um. Let's try it again. Uh. Fucking D. D. Okay. Um. We need a vowel, so we'll go A. Um, isn't that an anagram of dragon? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> we just flipped the A and the R, and it's a new word. Okay, that's fair enough. So we're in Yellowtown. We're gonna save right now because I don't trust. I don't trust anything. So this game has impressed me a fuck ton so far. Like I am. Um, Really truly in love with this game so far. Hi Agron, welcome to my lab. Thanks, Professor. I'm ready to help you now. Okay, I think your first Pokemon you should train and become a Pokemon Master and challenge the Zero League and it's eight gyms. Yes, I've dreamed all my life for this. And I now I make how how have you Okay, whatever. Right, but first I have one last request for you. To the east of Central City lies Marfany Lake. Professor Oak is at the lake and I urgently need you to speak with him. Can I ask you to get him to contact me? My dog is Fucking jumping around. What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that. That's right. Look away. <laughs> okay, go right away. Uh, is that it? Before you leave, here's a. Holy fuck! Wow. So if I didn't talk to her, would she have given it to me? No, I. She probably would have given it to me before I walked out the door. So. Once again, we're gonna save because, you know, fucking I'm a smart boy. But. I think we're almost at the end of this episode, so I'm not gonna go around and talk to people because, you know, I don't really care. That's a Shinx there, that's really nice. They're actually really nice sprites in this game. So what we're gonna do is Route 104. Um, whoa, oh god, don't run to a Pokemon. So we're, first of all, we're gonna check. We have an Adamant Charmander. Okay. I'm afraid to. Do we have Pokeballs, first of all? Uh, we do. Okay, so. Okay. Okay, we're good. So it's gonna be. A fucking Wurmple. A fucking Wurmple. <sighs> Brittany, man. I restarted my whole setup. Fucking Wurmple. <laughs> do I even bother catching this thing? Well, I mean. Catch it. It lived it lived on like one. I might as well. I might as well. If it breaks out, I'm leaving. Fuck this worm pole. Okay. 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 Uh Wormple was out of the Pokedex as a worm rear end. Um rear end, you say, yeah? Fucking um No, it doesn't have it. Oh, I don't have it. Oh, I wanted the um, the dollar sign. Oh, whoops. Does this work? This probably doesn't work. Oh. <laughs> we have asked the Wurmple. <laughs> Literally lived on one. Hardy nature. So again, uh, or not again, actually. Sorry. Uh, Charmander is adamant. Um, we have a fucking Wurmple. I don't know how to heal you. How do I heal? I'm assuming you just talk to your mom. Nope. 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 Okay, okay. Well, if you guys have enjoyed this very, very stressful episode 
Pokemon Light Platinum, the first episode, make sure to hit the like button down below first. And if you're not already subscribed, because this series will hopefully be daily. I'm hoping to upload um, an episode every weekday. So Monday to Friday, we will have an episode of Pokemon Light Platinum. And then on the weekends, we will have the league. So that's, that's going to be the setup. So if you guys are excited, make sure to hit the like button down below first. And with that being said, have yourselves a wonderful day. Bye-bye.